Charlie Company, Kylie Shepard, Benjamin Reynolds. Delta Company, Cole Chambers, Michael Schultz. Echo Company, Jordan Larson, Jeremy Platt.
four is an add-on of program where we were able to tabulate all the numbers. We had a bunch of the math, math geniuses be able to put this together. We're going to do the award for the best company, uh, which will be a streamer for the guide arm. So I we'll want the Charlie Company Commander and the uh, guide arm, Brian Barajas Post. Charlie Company, best company. So he will do that afterward, otherwise this will take all night long. Wow. Congratulations, Charlie. Are for the ladies, 
and Michael, Julie, give back on that. Why don't you have Brett help you out? Like that? Look for it. Lady awardees are Emily Cook, Cammie Munis, Hannah Ratliff, Krista yeah. Manzano, yeah. Peyton Douglas, Jasmine Gonzalez, Christine Neeson, Danielle Sandoval, Julia Stengel, and Gwen Terry.
names and we'll be forever memorialized on that trophy. Okay. The next award is the Academic Excellence Medal. It's awarded to a student with the highest school academic grades in each class. Okay, that's for RTC. These are awards were presented by, let's go with Ms. Teresa Merle. The award recipients are freshman Benjamin Reynolds, sophomore Marisol Garcia, junior Julia Stengel, senior Amir Aziz. The next award we're going to do is the Cadet and NCO of the Year Award. It is presented to the battalion's top cadets as selected by their fellow cadets through competitive monthly selection boards. These are unbelievable. It's just kind of your worst nightmare for a cadet to sit in front of all your peers and get evaluated on your military bearing, on your knowledge, and it's really, really tough. The selection process is culminated by the Cadet and NCO of the Semester and Year Boards. Uh, presenting the Cadet of the Year Award will be Cadet Sergeant Major Suzanne Allen and the Cadet of the Year. Uh, and this guy actually won Cadet of the Year for the entire brigade, Michal Hartman.
The NCO of the year, uh, this it have commands our Major Jim Hayes to come out and represent this. Is he still here? <coughs> Not Sir Major Elton. And Sir Major Hayes, if you could come on out. And our NCO of the year is Cadet Teresa Nielsen. Washoe County School District, the, the Nevada graduation rate overall. 
Lena High School is one of the top three high schools in the Washington County School District. But I tell you what, the RTC programs lead the way by getting these kids graduating. And most of them are actually going to the TMCC or they're going to college. What another big thing. These are the youngsters that are there behind the table doing all the hard work. These promotions recognize exceptional performance and hard work in the JRTC program. They are authorized by the Director of the Army Instruction, Lieutenant Colonel Scott Marriott. The following cadets will advance in grade. Battalion Commander, Nick Nelson. Battalion Command Sergeant Major, Brianna Salma. If the parents of these cadets could please join us for the promotion ceremony, do the pending on. Battalion, attention, attention to orders. The Director of Army Instruction has reposed special trust and competence in the patriotism, fidelity, and abilities of the following cadets. In view of this special trust and confidence and the demonstrated potential of these cadets, they are here promoted to the rank of assignment indicated. Nick Nelson, Cadet and Lieutenant Colonel. Brianna Soma. Cadet Command Sergeant Major. Signed, Lieutenant Colonel Scott Marriott, Director of Army Construction. Commander, Cadet Lieutenant Colonel Nick Nelson, who formally accepts command. 
The incoming commander now passes the colors to Lieutenant Colonel Teelander, who will in turn pass the colors into the safekeeping of the incoming Command Sergeant Major, Brianna Soma, who retires the colors. By this simple act, responsibility of the command changes. Please be seated. It is traditional for the outgoing commander to give some remarks and then be followed by the incoming commander. So uh, my journey here in ROTC has been an interesting one. I started off like most cadets and I was pretty much in it just for the credits. I just wanted to get my, my uh, what was it, one, two, five semesters. Yeah, I was like in it for five semesters and I was getting out. And at the time my brother, who was a senior when I was a freshman, was the battalion commander. And everybody was always like, oh, are you going to be battalion commander? And I was like, no. That isn't happening. And, uh, well, I'm kind of, yeah. <laughs> that, that changed. Um, and I think what did it was I started getting involved in the program and I met a lot of new people. I met some of my best friends in ROTC and just the overall experience that you get with all the activities and, like I said, the friends and the teachers which become your friends. Um, it's unremarkable and it's unbeatable with any other program that you can get in high school. Um, some of my highlights of my career in RTC, we did have our canned food drive this year. Normally our battalion raises around 2,000 cans for the uh, local food bank. And this year, with the help of my awesome battalion, we raised over 5,500 cans. So give them a round of applause. I also met some of my best friends in this program. Um, I have Amir, stand up. <laughs> like to embarrass him. Then there's Calvin. Uh, these two, I probably I met Calvin freshman year, first class I ever walked into. Calvin was there, so we we're like we we're bonded together. And then Amir has been my right hand man, and really I couldn't have done this whole year without Amir, and he's been my. Um, my man to go to on everything, and he's really made me look good as well as the battalion. So, everybody give me a round of applause. I also want to say one last thank you to, uh, I like to call her the mother of the battalion, that's Sonia Ruiz. And she really takes care of all of us. I'm sorry. And so, yeah. She's, she's our mother, and I really appreciate everything she's done for us. <laughs> and lastly, I'd like to thank my parents and all of you parents for all the things you've accomplished this year. Um, we wouldn't be able to do it without you guys' support. And from the looks of it, you guys are going to continue to support the program and even in even greater numbers with the enrollment we have next year. And so I look forward to seeing all the success that um, this battalion will have under next year's command. And I am very happy to be passing it off to one of my other very good friends, Nicholas Nelson. And so without further ado, I resign my command to Nicholas. not expect to be the guy I picked up. Uh, it's really a, still kind of a surreal feeling, I suppose, as a little sunk in yet. I have many people in my life to thank for giving me the confidence, first of all, to get to this position, to be my backing. That's all this Griswold family reunion going on right here. Uh, those who aren't here are here in spirit. 
for sure. Uh, I would also like to give a special thanks to my friend Thomas Lancaster. Thomas, go ahead and put your hand up for me. Or stand up, guy, yeah, whatever. Uh, without him, I wouldn't have even joined the program in the first place. I'd be elected. He's like, hey, do ROTC. Why not, right? 